Okay, we got a call here. Hello, caller. Who's this? Hey, uh, this is Nora. <laughs> What's up, Nora? <laughs> How's it going? I'm doing great. I'm doing great. All right. Should I tell you my dream now? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm all ready to go. I'm all ready to go. All right. So I interpreted this as a as a sleep dream. But I'll tell you about it. I had this one dream once. Um where uh, there was this guy, I was at this guy's house for dinner, and it turned, he came down the stairs, and he was actually a meatball, and uh, <laughs> Meat. he had, like, spaghetti and sauce, and we were sitting down at a table, and he gave me a drink. Can't quite remember what it was. Okay, so... And that's my dream. So you you had a food dream, and the person, uh, your your date, or the, the met you, you, this is a guy. How do you know it was a guy? You just knew it was a guy. I'm assuming it was a guy. His name was Bill. Bill, okay. And did he have arms and legs, or was he just just straight up meatball? No, no arms and legs. It was like a snail kind of thing. Like and he left like a saucy trail. Oh wow! So just kind of oozing everywhere. Oh yeah. Oh wow! And what, did you eat any of him, or any, or what did you eat? Then? No, 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 no. I, I can't remember. Okay, were you? Were you intrigued? I mean, did you like the situation that was there in front of you, or? Uh, I can't. I remember being a little weirded out, but yeah, I stayed. Stayed for dinner. So you did stay for dinner. What was for dinner? I can't remember what was for dinner. Um, probably spaghetti, maybe. Sp but he has, and he has a lot of spaghetti like entangled around his meatball body. Oh, nice. And I think he had glasses. And a mustache. Oh, oh, okay. Had had glasses and a mustache. Okay, great. That's that's good to know. Okay, so let me. What what do you think this dream's a? Uh, what how do you think this dream? What does this represent? How do you feel like this dream is saying to you? Oh man, I don't know. Maybe I need to eat better. Too much spaghetti. You, yeah, yeah. We like it could be. Well, you know, a lot of times on pizza boxes and various um italian restaurants they have that kind of happy-go-lucky a cartoon figure and um you know it could be it could be you might have saw one of those cartoon guys like on a pizza it box could or have something. Been. it probably what yeah like almost like the planter's peanut guy yeah or the meatball yeah or chef borardi guy you know yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, but you and he just was shorter than me. Oh, okay. Well, it was a small meatball. Mm -hmm. I got him big here. I made him. Well, no, he was big. He was like human size, but he was shorter than me. Gotcha. Because he has no arms or legs. Yeah, he didn't have arms or legs, but he must have had. He was holding a drink, so he must have had some sort of. Uh, was it was it like a glass of wine, or was it just like a beer or something? It was. It was either the wine, it wasn't a beer, it was in a glass, like wine or maybe a martini, I'm not quite sure. Okay, it could be wine, like a red wine, yeah, yeah usually, um, yeah. that pairs good with the, with a, you know, Italian food, usually. It does. Yeah, I think it's probably a glass of red wine. Great. Uh, do you think this was a nightmare, or was it just a wonderful experience? Oh, definitely not a nightmare. It was just... Yeah, it was just an experience, and I'm glad I had it. So you were kind of like laughing at this guy a little bit. <laughs> uh, I definitely woke up laughing. <laughs> but you weren't laughing at at the meatball necessarily. No, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. no, no. Just at the absurdity of the situation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. T totally absurd. But uh, it's a wonderful experience to 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 have. <laughs> it uh, was. You know, to to have a dream where you're eat, you know, eating dinner with a with a, you know, a, just a meatball. You know, usually, mm -hmm. usually, uh, you have dinner. You you might have maybe dinner with a meat head. You know, that happens. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, but so, this was a meatball meat head. This is a meatball, so he was a little better. Uh, it was just a better uh, situation, I think, for everybody. Uh, it was all around. Yeah, I think I, uh, I think this is a A one dream. This is like a a class A one dream, I believe. It was great. It was great. 
do you do a lot of dreams or uh, how, how do, how, how's your dream? Uh, how do your dreams operate? Do you, do you, do you know, you, you know, do you have a lot of them that you remember and all? No, I mean, I smoke weed before bed. I tend to not to dream before yeah, or that once one... after, you know, but if I wake up, yeah. And then go back to bed, I'll dream. But yeah. I can't quite, you know, it, it depends. It really depends. Sometimes I'll wake up and I have a crazy dream and I can remember it. Most of the time, no. Yeah, yeah, the weed apparently does uh, retard the dreams or kind of masks the dreams that you might have. messes with your REM. But you, it's also, it feels good. Yeah, so that was a good one, though. I'm glad I remembered that one. That is a great dream. That's like, that's like you know, again, one of the greatest dreams ever. Ever? Yeah, I think that's one of the greatest oh, dreams ever. I'm going to put that up top. That's like top shelf. I'm honored. Yeah. <laughs> well, thanks, Nora, for your dream. That's, a, that's a, right. just a beautiful dream. Yeah, thank you so much. Thanks for chatting. Thanks for painting. Yeah, yeah. And thanks for... Keep at it. Yeah, thanks for calling. I appreciate that. I was just going to follow... Yeah. Fall asleep until someone called. So, well, I'm I'm glad I did. All right. Well. Uh, All right. Sweet dreams. <laughs> All right. Bye. Bye.